Lane Kiffin returning to Southern Cal as the Trojans head coach after just one year at Tennessee. Lauren Shahadi, Dennis Dodd, your college football columnist. Here with you, Dennis. Kiffin chosen Tuesday to replace Pete Carroll. What was your first thought when you hear, heard the news? Shock and <laughs> awe. Yeah. I, uh, I got off a plane last night and I had a text waiting for me that said uh, Lane Kiffin had been hired at USC, done deal. I thought someone was playing a joke on me. I had to call and make sure and say to this guy, are you serious? And I think that's what the rest of the college football world was thinking. This is, this is a guy with, I mean, be, beyond the fact that, you know, Mike Garrett, the AD, you know, stepped in it again in the coaching search the last time he got lucky with Pete Carroll. Lane Kiffin is a, is a 12 and 21 coach, um, you know, who has as many secondary violations of Tennessee as he did victories last year. And not not to mention all his uh, tweaks of uh, of rival coaches and programs. This is going to be very interesting. I think is the best way to put it. You mentioned athletic director Mike Garrett. Can Mike Garrett and Lane Kiffin win together? And I asked you that question because I already read your column. What do you think? Well, they can't win together because I, you know, whether whoever he hired, I think Mike Garrett is gone. Their their president Steve Sample is due to retire this year. And logically thinking, you would think whoever came in there as a new president, want to bring his own AD. Certainly since Mike Garrett has put this program, uh, is going to put this program on probation in football. We already had the self-penalized situation in basketball. Um, you know, he, he poisoned the waters enough to let uh, Pete Carroll get away. I think Mike Garrett's numbers, even even if Lane Kiffin wins big like Pete Carroll did, did his days are not at USC. What impact, uh, Dennis, does this decision have on recruiting for both schools? Can Kiffin keep USC's top recruits and bring in Tennessee ones? Yeah, I think he'll keep the recruiting class together, and that's part of his uh, attraction is he's a very good recruiter. He, he got a good uh, class in Tennessee last year in late notice. He was at, some, at one point in the offseason the number one rated class to Tennessee. So the, the thinking is that he'll be able to wrap up this class. There are so many kids that were starting to look elsewhere that he committed to other schools, that USC was in danger of you know, ha losing this recruiting class, a situation that's not going to show up until two or three years down the line, actually, you know, when these guys are supposed to mature. So he'll do that in the short term. But you know, and also in the long term, he's going to have to win. They're going to have to go to Rose Bowls. Well, it begs the question, where does this leave Tennessee, who is now looking for their second coach in as many years, Dennis? Well, Lauren, this rips Tennessee to shreds right now. They are absolutely in shock that this happened 14 months after Lane Kiffin was hired. You know, the image is still fresh of him standing up at the podium saying, I can't wait to do the vol walk, uh, sing Rocky Top the, the night when we beat Florida. Uh, now they're in disarray. They have to do something in the next 24 to 48 hours, I would think, to shore up their recruiting class. And the names you hear are David Cutcliffe, the head coach at Duke, who is an offensive coordinator under Phil Fulmer. And Will Muschamp in Texas, who uh, is the defensive coordinator there. Interesting thing with Will Muschamp, he's the coach in waiting when Mac Brown retires. But that doesn't look like it's going to be any time soon. He's being paid $900,000 to be the coordinator there. And I think at 38, 39 years old right now, he'd have to take a serious look at Tennessee. That, wouldn't be, that would be a great job to start off your head coaching career. For sure. We will see how it all works out. Monty Kiffin will join his son on USC staff. Lane Kiffin to USC after just one year at Tennessee. For Dennis Dodd, I'm Lauren Shahadi. We'll see you soon.